Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with another episode of Napoleon Total War, the Darth mod. We are playing as the United Kingdom, and we are putting a pincer move on France very slowly, I might add. It's a very slow pincer, but a pincer nonetheless. I'm looking at this drill school down in the uh, province of Marseille, and if I uh, upgrade it to a drill school, I'll be able to get the Earl of Uxbridge. I have no idea what that unit is, but I want to find out. So I'm going to go ahead and do that upgrade if I can. Oh, it won't let me. Oh, I don't have mass mobilization yet. Oh, darn. Okay, let's see. <laughs> let's see where mass mobilization is here. Uh, mass mobilization. Where would that be? Mass mobile. I would think it'd be under conscription. Oh, here it is, right here. Okay, one more turn and I'll have conscription done. Then I can do mass mobilization. Then I'll be able to get this drill school. Then I'll be able to get the Earl of Uxbridge, which is interesting. It sounds like a unique unit, and uh, I wouldn't mind having that. So in the meantime, I'm not going to do anything with that. We do have five thousand gold. I think I'm going to need some fleets down here to uh, help protect against uh, the French. I might just go ahead and upgrade this port of the uh, Gibraltar. And I do need a couple more merchantmen. I'll go ahead and grab those before I do the upgrade. And I might need some, some gunnery down here to uh, help protect against this French fleet. Now, the, the Russians are down here. I don't know what they're doing down here, but they're probably going to grab those trade slots that I emptied up by losing to the uh, to the French but I don't know that for sure I do have one merchantman here I could send him over or I just might just send him down here to one of these places and grab some extra income from here all right yeah great how much how much am I getting from this 22. 22.88 if I take him back out I'm getting 1900 so yeah that's worth it that's worth it okay he'll pay for himself in the turn or two all right so that's good we'll get that going I will go ahead and grab just a couple more merchant man from here that way I have several getting built at the same time I will go ahead and bring our navy fleet that we had down as well all right he's uh he's on his way down and what are we going to do about up here? We probably need to get a few upgrades and recruits up here. A court of justice, what would that get us? Interesting, yes. I wouldn't mind having a metric system. Hmm. That's 3,000 for that, though. Uh, I don't have a barracks in London. Let's <laughs> go ahead and get that. Okay. <clears throat> so my recruitment in London is actually quite limited. So that's uh, that's kind of funny. That I uh, never thought to get one <laughs> in there. Uh, priorities, priorities. Okay, so that's that's uh, that's all my money. And so that's all the planning that we get to do. Uh, he is going to try to push forward, I'm sure, with this army. And this army. And this army. So he's pulled all his armies that he is bringing out that way. Back over to the west. Which means, in essence, I might be able to move forward with this army. And uh, push into this town. And I might be able to draw some of them back out. I hope. Duke of Wellington, I wanted to get reinforced over here. Against this army. Because he's going to move against this army almost certainly. So should I initiate the attack? Or wait for the Duke of Wellington to arrive? Is the question. That is the way he's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units, and I have no idea what they are. Oh, decisions, decisions. Okay. Lots of foot coming in there. Nice, well rounded army coming in there. Now, not good. It's got a 12 pounder, even. Oof. Several armies coming in. Okay. Well, that's not good. Maybe time to, to call the retreat, but not quite yet. How are we doing down here? This guy recruited, and he's going to be moving into this army over here. Yep. 
go. Some extra foot over there. Okay. So I could start moving these guys up north to offer reinforcement as well. And these guys are almost healed up. Could start moving them up north as well. I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and move them up north. Not quite healed up, but uh, we're going to need them. So I'm going to go ahead and move them. And then you know what? I'll go ahead and move him as well. We're going to have many armies on the field as we can. As many armies on the field as we can. Okay, let's go. Let's end the turn. Let's see what the French do. And just as I had supposed, he come to relieve the... Uh oh, that's not good. He would he uh, relieved the assault on Normandy, but he didn't finish him off. Strangely, oi there! What's this? Two line infantry and what is this guy? A guard de Paris. The chunky boys, aren't they? They've been eating that cheese and wine. Mm. I'm a retreat. Prepare a new defense. Let's see what we got here. Let's take him and merge him up with this army. Anything more? Thank you for doing a good job scouting. I got an armchair general. That sounds familiar, doesn't it? Research points per turn for military technologies one. Oh, that's nice. Uh, I do have a new general available. Uh, Frederick of York and Albany. Okay. That's good. I have a technology advance. Okay, research is complete. Conscription. Uh, he's researching diamond formation. No thanks. Uh, and then in Salamanca, I researched the division of labor. So let's see. Let's take take a look at our uh, research screen and see what we got going on there. I built a merchant house in Spain. That's good. Awesome. What does that give me more wealth? Great. Exactly what I needed. Nation joins my enemies. The kingdom of Spain. Uh, what? 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 <laughs> what? You dirty rats. You dirty, dirty, turd loving rats. He's going to run right for Madrid. I've got bare minimum of garrisons here. All right, so let's throw in some, um, some troops here. Get some cheap line infantry. Yep. Oh my god. Why? Why Spanish? Why? Now I'm gonna have to uh, change my change my plan of attack here. Okay, so what's he got going on? He's got several armies scattered out. I'm gonna take this army and I'm gonna smash this guy. Yeah. Ooh. Smashing? Uh, not sure about smashing. He's actually got a better artillery. I've got more cav. But cav's really... A little... It can be a little iffy. I'm going to go and retreat. Oh, what? No, don't go back up there! <laughs> No, he's dead. Okay. And that was that was foolish. Alright. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring this army up. Uh, I'm gonna move right up there. And Duke of Wellington. Yep, we're raiding that trade route. Good. And then Duke of Wellington's gonna go attack him. Now we're talking. Chase them down. All right, so we're we're occupying Orléans, and let's see if I can move him back at all. Not is, that, is he going to be in the zone of reinforcement? No, no, not quite. He might be in that one. I move him up just a little. Yep. Can you now get in Orléans? No, you can't. Okay, so he's reinforcing him, and he's reinforcing him. So that's. About as good as I can do, I think. 
That's about as good as I can do. All right, he's building up a navy in that port, unfortunately. Okay. Yes. Now I'm about to bring this army back down south somehow. That's the only pass I can move through. But I'm gonna have to move them down here because stinking Spanish. Okay. Let me go ahead and move down here. Merge up. Okay, good. Bordeaux is gonna have to get some recruits as well, but I don't have any money. Alright, so we are stripping our garrison, so to speak. Uh, what have we got over here? Maybe time to make a move over here and attack this town of Milan. Should I be pushing further forward east when I know that I have trouble back in the west? Probably not, but now it is. Okay, I'm going to continue that siege for now. This army. I'm going to move back up here. I'm just going to see if I can intercept those armies. Yes. 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 Now these guys might be able to cause me a little trouble, but not too much, I don't think. I cannot believe the Spanish declared war on me. That's just rude. That's just rude. Okay. Well, I'm going to send a diplomat to Spain and say, what's up? Do you want a peace treaty? Uh, and they're rejected utterly. Um, I could give him something. I could give him Spain. <laughs> no thanks. No. Uh, I could, I could demand some. Territory. I should probably just smash him. Just redirect my efforts. Come down here and just smash him and say, to hell with France. But I'm not going to. I'm going to try to divide my effort. Which is foolish, but that's what I'm going to try to do. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, Alright. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to push on Milan first. And then we'll... Uh, after we take Milan, we can decide what to do with Spain all right we are here he's got the town as I would have supposed there's a nice hill here for our artillery to fire from yes sir and yes, limba we got over here we got uh, militia foot 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 Damn this weather, sir. Wet powder makes misfires a certainty. Yes. All right. So he's got a couple of militias on each flank. I don't have any cavalry with this with this army. So let's grab a couple of foot. We're gonna move them over here. Yes, I'll put one British Dutch foot back here. Yes, British Dutch foot over here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take this this yes, weak weakened unit. They're going to be protecting the, the artillery because they're more than likely not going to be directly engaged. All right, principles. Old center. Surrounded by your superiors. Like so. More principles. I'll help them support this artillery. Alright, British Dutch, we're going to move this way with these armies. Okay, alright, I think we're good. We'll have a militia flank as well. General Staff's going to hide behind this hill. There we go. I think we're ready. I think we're ready. Oh, one more British Dutch infantry, okay. My bad. Oh, look at this. He can, he can do a flanking maneuver. Okay, here we go. You guys move forward. 
move forward. Cannon are firing. You guys move forward. Hold that ridge. Double time. Double time. Double time. Double time. All right. Move on up there. Okay. Very good. Nice. He's pulling back. Okay. Get ready to come under fire there, boys. Oh, he's got Cav over here. And he's got... General Staff and these Lancers. Great. Get ready to form square. Form square. Oh, cow. That's his reinforcements, I guess. And he's got grenadiers coming in. Okay. He's attacking our square. You form square as well. Okay. Alright, we got a good hold in the center going forward. Okay. Move up. Guys, come over here. All right, we're pushing those guys off. Good. We have killed their general. Sir. Oh my God, we killed their general. That's the general staff attacking us. Wow, that's what a foolish move. It wasn't even their lancers. Okay, well, we got here more foot. One squirt. One squirt. Doing good there. Pretty maids all in a row. Like that. Guys, move forward. To the flank. Nice. What are these guys doing? He's getting ready to charge somewhere else. Okay. Fun square. Where are you going? coming up here. Form square. Got him. Got him. Alright, good. Idiot. That was the worst use of cavalry I've ever seen. Worse than my use of cavalry. Even. Okay. We're holding good in the center. This right flank's uh, kind of iffy because we got this artillery moving up. It's protected by a unit of cav. Oh, it's another general. Okay. We got over here fusiliers, grenadiers, conscripts. Okay. I'm not worried about the conscripts. Go ahead and move forward. Like so. Make sure everybody's got a good line of sight. They do. Getting those guys smashed. Nice. He's going to break. Due to. Getting flanked. Got our militia holding up there. That's good. Awesome. Move forward a little bit. Keep firing. What do you got? Conscripts. Okay. Very good. We broke those uh, militia. Grenadiers are coming up. So we have to be careful of those. This guy's going to be pretty pretty professional. Swiss Grenadiers. I've got some of those in my own. They are pretty good. Uh oh. This guy's losing his uh, morale a little bit. Okay. Okay, we're doing good over here still. Another cavalry charge was repulsed. Wheel around militia. Okay, we got the left link for sure. Looking good in our rear at the moment. All right, we got over here general staff. Oh, watch out. He's going to get flanked. 
turn. Form square. Form square. Right now. Form square, everybody. Uh oh. That was pretty sharp. That was pretty sharp. He's going to rush now with these guys. We need reinforcements over your stat. Double time militia. You guys move up. You guys move up. Okay. You guys form up over here. That's those guys. Cannon's still firing. All right, general staff broke. Come out of square. Uh oh. These fusiliers are gonna charge us. It's not gonna be good. Get ready to fire them in. Should be able to fire over their heads, I think. Come on, man. You think they're really trying to kill us, Corporal? <laughs> I love that. I haven't heard that one before. That's hilarious. Yeah, they're trying to kill us. And we're trying to kill them. You think they're really trying to kill us, Corporal? Oh, this guy's not looking good morale-wise. Okay. Doing good, doing good. Keep it up, fellas. Keep it up. Guys, guard police. Alright, are they under fire from artillery or something? No. Small arms fire, it says. Alright, we got the grenadiers off. These fusiliers are still gonna be a problem. Let's move these guys into a better position. They're currently not in a great position. There's so much black powder smoke. It's crazy. Okay. Alright. You're gonna have to either move up this way or move up this way. Kind of gonna be flanked either way, so let's just move forward just a little bit. Right. You turn. Fire. There we go. Doing good here. Doing good. Alright. Can you go after these guys? Double time over there. Get that cannon out. Okay. You guys come back, rest. This foot is gonna, he's got a dangerous mission. Whew, all right. Time that. You guys move over there. You guys move up over here. You guys move up. There we go. Get out of the line of fire, please. You guys charge those. Charge them before they get here. French garrison's coming. Uh, I think it might be too late. You guys are going to have to retreat. They won't be able to bring their cannons to bear, but these guys might get wiped out. Uh, guys. <laughs> Where are you going? Well, I mean, you took the long way around, okay, but... Hundred brave men there. Uh oh, who used all their ammunition? This guy did. He's he's out out of the pot. Come on up. You guys moving back up? Okay. Militia, you stay on him. These two units come over here. All right. You guys keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. Those guys broke. That's okay, I broke the cannons first. 
Lost about 25, 30 men on that charge. Grenadiers are coming back. Okay. All right. I think we got this in the bag, fellas. We got this in the bag. Go forward. Go forward. What's our threats at right now? Threat assessment. We got some fusiliers in the back line. We got some garrison in the back line. Let's get our general up to help support. You guys, come back over here. Did a great job, by the way. Oh, nice. A glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. Yeah, we just about got this. All right, pushed off the grenadiers. Okay. Militia, come hold this while these guys maneuver. Keep moving that way. Keep moving up that way. I want to make sure these cannon are firing at the right people here. Let's fire at these guys over here. It's chunky boys. And it's a garrison, so it should break relatively easy under artillery fire, I think. <clears throat> Go ahead and get into position, militia. Oh, we got here. Fusiliers? Okay. That's going to be less than ideal. But, that can be good. Oh, Grenadiers. Where are my Grenadiers, by the way? They're over here. Okay. Come on over. That's brutal. Oh my god. That's brutal. Alright, so he's out of ammo. Who else is out of ammo? Super stretch guy here. Come on back. General, come on up. Support these guys. Alright, you guys move up. You guys move on up. You guys move up. You guys move up. There we go. Alright, this uh, militia unit is in a bad position. Move over that way. Move that way. This foot. Move up right here. Okay, about got this, guys. Just about got this. All right, he's out of ammo. This guy's almost out of ammo. This guy's almost out of ammo. Okay. Double time, it, please, guys. It's just about time to finish this battle off here. Nice. You ready, Corporal? Do you really think they're trying to kill us, Corporal? This is an interesting view. Okay. That particular soldier couldn't see squat. Let's see what this guy sees. What do you see, bro? Smoke. <laughs> lots and lots of smoke.
you see your brothers in front of you. So do you. Okay. Yep, got one guy pushed off. That's good. One of our units has used all its ammunition, sir. Oh no. You need to come out. Come on out. Alright, these guys coming out of the line. These guys going back into the line. Swiss Grenadiers. Come on up. Because this British Dutch is almost out of uh, ammo as well. In fact, this guy is out of ammunition as well. Wow. Okay. Come on back. You guys move forward. Inspire your troops, General. There you go. Yes, sir. Oh my god, this militia is just like punching it out with this other garrison unit here. Okay, you guys moving that, that slot. Okay, you're gonna hold there. Okay. Do you have ammo? No. Do you have ammo? No. Neither one of those guys have ammo. Keep firing on these guys. I got a break. He's got plenty of ammo. He's got quite a bit of ammo. Alright. Grenadiers, how you doing? See him standing there. Kill the enemy general. Oh, he's running. He's running. Kill two enemy generals. Wow. Interesting. You had two generals in that army? Just need to figure out a way to get an angle on these guys through all these buildings, which is not going to be easy. Oh, they're running. Okay. Ah, we did it. Okay, great. Woo! Rogue victory. I was pretty pleased with that. Okay, we lost a thousand men. They lost almost 3,500, or a little over 3,500. So that's great. That's great. Bye. We're going to peacefully occupy, occupy northern Italy here. Uh-oh, it's doing that weird sound effect thing. <laughs> well, uh, that, what's that about? Okay, let's uh, repair this building. Can't afford to repair it. Oh, darn. Okay, so I can't recruit here. Nope. Darn. Shucky darn. Alright, so what's he got left here? Just a little bit of uh, conscripts. I could send an army out and smash them, I guess. Could send these grenadiers out and smash them. Can I reach them? I don't know if I can reach them. He does have a couple more armies over here. Looks like Austria is pushing in from the east. And if I could clear Italy, that'd be great. He's only got one more army here in Rome. It's a big one, though. Okay. Well, we got that cleared. Uh, we have left ourselves kind of open here um, in southern France. So he may try to bring these armies down and cause a little trouble. But right now, they're, these are pretty weak armies. Um, I am worried about these armies in Spain. He can't quite make it to Madrid with this with these armies in one turn, so that'll give us time to recruit for sure. I'll have uh, at least a rudimentary army in there before they can cause too much trouble. I could send this army up as well to help defend. Oh man, the arm <laughs> the music's all messed up. I'm gonna leave this guy in here for. 
for now. <laughs> Nothing like some good old e e e e e. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and end the turn, and then we'll um. Hmm. Should I send this guy over here, or or push them further? And how much are we getting? Thirty four fifty six. How much are we getting from five hundred? I'll just send him over here. We we'll get some more tea. We need more tea. Okay. So, uh, let's go ahead and end the turn, and then we'll probably end this episode. Oh, my God. What are you thinking? Look, look what he's doing here. An opportunity to intercept. Look at all those armies. Holy cow. I wish I could pan around and look and see what all he's got over here. He's trying to move Louis Beaumarquais. Beaumarquais, maybe, I don't know. He's trying to move him, and I have an opportunity to intercept with all of my armies. Yeah. I definitely will intercept him, and, uh, and attack him. He's probably going to do several attacks here, so I'm going to go ahead and save it. Save the game. Yep. And we're going to call this episode quits here. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, be sure and hit that like button. Next episode, something big's going to happen at Pyre. Bye.